Okay, so I like to do April Fool's dinner. We do it every year. So this year we did a Mario themed dinner. So everything is code worded. So they have no idea what they're ordering. They have no idea what they're eating with. They have no idea what they're drinking. And just kind of is like a, a random splurge of stuff. So you can see Brooklyn ordered her chicken nuggets with a whisk, a, a, a beer, a beater. <laughs> I don't even know, that's a meat something or other. I've never seen anyone use this before. <laughs> Why do you and, have and this? And Aimee over here has got her clipping spaghetti. <laughs> Okay, we added a twist. Now she's got to eat with a certain restriction. <laughs> she's got to eat with her elbows. Garrett's supposed to be speaking in a British accent. <laughs> Say something. <laughs> Say something. Say <laughs> something. No. <laughs> Everyone, like, she's got to eat upside down or backwards. She's got to eat with the bowl on her head, and she's got to eat with her le her left hand, her non-dominant hand. Hey, Dax and Paisley, Easter Bunny came while we were out of town. Yes. And what did he do? He hit it. He There's hit only eggs. two different colors because the rest of my sisters are in Utah. Yeah, they're in Utah. They already got theirs, but because you were asleep, you get to do yours this morning. Yeah. Okay, so what color are you, Paisley? I'm yellow. Yellow, Daxton? Blue. Three, two, one, go. Go, find the basket. I feel like it's... <laughs> <laughs> I wish you guys clean your room in the house as much as you do for eggs. Ooh, I think you're kind of cold in here. Ooh, what is that? Oh, there's Daxton. You nice. found it, huh? Nice. Ooh, now you get to go find your eggs. Hurry, you hurry, 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 okay, hurry, hurry, hurry. Whoever, so whoever, 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 whoever gets them first, whoever gets them all first, whoever gets them all first. Where is he? Let's see. Where are you, Dax, buddy? Oh, will you let Finn in? Let Finn in really quick. Bye. Remember when you used to do this? Last year. Last <laughs> year. <laughs> Over COVID. Yeah. That was about the only fun we had last year, huh? Yeah, pretty much. Because we couldn't go anywhere. <laughs> Put them on the counter right here so we can count them. Put them right here. Last year, I'm one of my eggs was in here. <laughs> yeah, I, I hit that there. That was a good spot. <laughs> a good spot. It was. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Daxon, now you have three more, and Ryland ha or Paisley has four. You didn't count these. Oh, wow, I think she's beating you, buddy. Count them all. You might have them all. One, two, three. 10, 11, 12. How many eggs are we? I think there are 12. Oh, Paisley wins. Let's okay. see, what did Easter Bunny give you? Lip balm. Jolly Rancher lip balm. Bubble machine. Bubble machine. Reese's eggs. Oh, those are for me. <laughs> you don't like peanut butter. No. Oh, are you serious? No, I mean, I was joking. No, I don't, don't like peanut them? butter. Oh, are you serious? Hey, score. <laughs> A two. A two for the pool. What do you say to the Easter Bunny? Thank you. Say thank you, Mr. Easter Bunny. I won the challenge, and I started later. <laughs> <laughs> okay, buddy, oh, let's wait, see what you I'm have. Going. Oh, there it is. <laughs> it was there all along. We're like, let's just go the look what's in your egg. basket. Okay. And this? Yeah. I got Legos. You got some Legos. Cookie. I got more Legos. More Legos. I got diving toys. Oh, that'll be fun. Except you don't really dive, do you? No. That goes in your shower door so you can hang some things that I think you already have, so. I got two fruit snacks. Two fruit nice. snacks. I candy. Gum. Bubble gum. Ooh, yum. He doesn't A pool toy. A pool floaty. <laughs> All right, what do you say, Daxton? Thank you, Easter Bunny. Good morning, guys. So I thought I'd take you along this week on um, our trip like a little adventure we're doing. Brooklyn Bailey and Sana and I are going to Utah to do a bunch of work meetings and various things. We're gonna go bridal shopping for Bailey, but we're also doing a ton of warehouse tours so we know how to set up our warehouse. When we get it next month, um, we're just heading to the airport, so. Ugh, so tired. I went to bed it. I don't know why I'm doing like a walk down memory lane today. We're driving through Provo, Oregon. Brooklyn. She's checking out different schools and we drove past BYU and I had to drive past Sean and I's old apartment, our first apartment together. 
Then we had to drive past. This is so funny. One of my first apartments I lived in at school was called, you guys are gonna die, Heritage Halls. And the reason that's funny is because that's where we met and started dating. And now I own a hair company called Heritage. It came full circle. Also adding to the weirdness of it all, Brooklyn and Bailey went and lived at Baylor and lived in their first apartment, also called Heritage. Weird. Here's the rest of the crew. We're checking out schools and living situations for Brooklyn. Mm -hmm. Bailey's working on wedding planning in the back seat. Yes, I am. Sun is keeping us all organized. Fine. We're trying to convince <laughs> her to try a bunch of different treats. <laughs> so you guys know part of our plan for coming to Utah was to come to a bunch of different warehouses and learn about how they have things set up or things they're doing that are working, things they're doing that aren't working so that we try to avoid some of the mistakes and hit some of the positive results quicker. So today we are at Sense of Style slash Be Fulfilled, Courtney and John, and they are so great about sharing. So we're in this, this is kind of their oversized common space, which is where they do a bunch of photo shoots. Then check this out. Like this is just a little tiny piece of their warehouse. And we're taking pictures and learning all the things, shelving and boxes and how to set it up and how to set up pack stations and make ours better and more efficient. This cute wall too on the side of their building. So like you can take all kinds of color pictures. Okay guys, so I wanted to give you guys a little bit of a Utah trip recap. I um, had such a blast. I kind of like didn't make plans at all. That was kind of like what I wanted to do while I was out there, was just like come up with things as I went. One with, I spent a lot of time with Camry. We, I went and toured like BYU a little bit. I didn't really get a lot of vlog footage of most of that, but I also hung up Brockton, Boston and Castle a lot. We went up the canyon. There's a lot of that on their channels so um yeah definitely like i had such a blast i mean it's not a secret but i did go on my first date that's also not part of this vlog <laughs> but yeah i'm trying to think of anything else like i literally had such a fun time um hanging out with everyone and like just seeing people like i haven't seen them in like two three years like my family my friends so i had so much fun and i hope y'all enjoyed my little segment on here okay we are at Daxon's last track beat i'm gonna cover the mic so you don't have to win Jackson's last track meet, he's running the mile and a half, 2,400 meters. I'm here with my best friend from high school, Sean Carlson. <laughs> we'll see how he does. There he goes. And our 2,400 meter point oh, away. Uh, field, which is uh, more fields, Devin, Devin, Devin. There he is, coming on the screen. So I am visiting the office today. You know, guys know I was gone all last week. There's been like a gazillion delays with supplies this year because of pandemic, COVID, storm, Suez Canal, name it. So here's where we're at right now. I Last time I was here, they just had insulation. This time there's actually sheetrock going up, which is good, but I'll, I'll show you what it looks like where we're at. It's not done yet, the sheetrock's not, but making progress. So you can see the front entry doors. They are uh, doing the stucco on the outside. So everything's covered in plastic right now. So we have like, I don't know, three fourths of the walls covered in sheetrock. And looks like all of our fire sprinklers are in now. Sheetrock. It's a lot quieter with the insulation in. It's like so much quieter. Conference room, hallway, you can see. There's no sheetrock in the warehouse yet. I feel like we're just about to the point where it's gonna start like getting really exciting and looking like paint and cupboards and trim and all the stuff that makes it feel so much prettier. And right now it's just kind of, I don't know, I feel like this middle stage has lasted 10 years. Another little office right there and then you can see the warehouse is pretty much the same as it was before. Good morning, you guys. So we did an Airbnb trip with friends and the Airbnb's water isn't working. 
The owner is coming to fix it, but it's been very interesting because we have toilets not working, sinks not working. <laughs> the only drinking water we have is the water bottles we happened to get yesterday at the store. So quite the adventure. You can take a peek at the cute little Airbnb and I'll take you outside for a second to show you the rest. Here you can see the bridge going down there. And then you've got a little bench down there and a little dock that you can like jump off of. Unfortunately for us, the weekend that we booked, we thought was gonna be warm and now it's like 58 degrees. So there's not gonna be any swimming for us. But we get to play games all day. So at least there's that. And hopefully the water thing gets fixed because this air review is so cute. Just missing the water part. <laughs> anyway, just thought I'd update y'all on what we're spending our weekend doing. Sometimes it's nice to just like get out and go somewhere, so. It's freezing. It's freezing. And these crazy people are about to jump into the water. Hi. And I know there are people who live in a lot colder places, but we are weak. We live in Texas. And the water is so, we're like, it's so cold outside right now. Yeah, it's cold. And they're about to. <laughs> 